Hey everybody, welcome to today's episode of Cruise News, and in today's episode, Carnival is bringing back a special perk for their highest loyalty members. Uh, Disney has upped the price on some of their specialty dining, and Port Everglades is going to have five new cruise ships that are leaving there next summer. All of these stories are going to be in today's episode of Cruise News. Hey everybody, thanks for checking out the channel. If you are new here, please think about hitting that like and subscribe button. I post these cruise news videos every other day, followed by theme park news in the opposite days, on top of vlogging all of our adventures. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the like button if you're enjoying this video so far. Make sure you leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought about today's news stories. Uh, so let's go ahead and get right into these news stories. All right, Carnival has announced that they are bringing back a favorite for their highest level of the VIFP program. That's their loyalty reward program. For diamond level members, uh, they used to have a lunch that uh, on each cruise you would be able to go to a special lunch if you were a diamond member. That was kind of scaled back to just being kind of like a cocktail party. They, uh, John Heald, the uh, brand ambassador, has announced that the actual lunch will be coming back for those members only. That's the diamond level, which is the very top tier on the loyalty program. That will be coming back. Uh, he said that will be around August 1st. There wasn't a specific date on if that's going to be all the ships, if it's going to be staggered among the ships. Not real specific on it, but around August, he said that will be coming back. They do have a couple different lunch menu options, but if you are a Diamond member on Carnival Cruises, you will be able to once again have the special Diamond level lunch uh, on your cruise. All right, and speaking of food on a cruise ship, Disney Cruise Lines, for the second time this year, has announced they are raising the prices for some of their specialty dining. Uh, these are going to be increased. Increase, yeah, these are going to be increased at the following restaurants. I'll get that out: uh, Palo, the Palo Steakhouse, Remy, and Enchante. Enchante. I don't know how to pronounce that. It's got a little thing at the end. Uh, all of those restaurants are going to be having a, a, a price increase. Like I said, it's going to be the second time this year that they have had that price increase. Uh, this will be on the Disney Magic, Fantasy, Wonder, Dream, and the Wish. Uh, the Remy and the Enchante, or I, like I said, I don't know how you pronounce that. <laughs> I'm probably saying it wrong. Uh, the price per person increases um, to $10. The other uh, restaurants, the price will go up $5. So nothing huge and major or anything like that. But, you know, hey, 5 and 10 per person. You know, definitely not 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 chump change. Uh, so those prices will go up. Like I said, that's going to be, um, it didn't say the exact date that that was going to take effect. I think it's immediate. Um, however, they did say that if you've already booked these restaurants, you will get the lower price. And But if you haven't and you have, you know, you're going to be booking them basically from now on, uh, you will have to pay the actual extra charge. So like I said, the two restaurants, $10 extra per person. The other restaurants are $5 extra per person, and that's on Disney, uh, Magic, Fantasy, Wonder, Dream, and Wish, and that's just for the specialty dining restaurants. And also, if you enjoy going out of Fort Lauderdale, the Port Everglades port, they did mention that there is going to be five new ships starting next summer, part of the summer uh, season next uh, year, that these ships are going to be coming to Port Everglades. That is going to be the Ce Celebrity Beyond, the Enchanted Princess, the Freedom of the Seas from Royal Caribbean, the Celebrity Reflection, and the Disney Magic. All of those ships are coming to Port Everglades in the summer of 2024. Um, trying to, I guess, they're trying to increase the... Uh, a number of ships and, and stuff like that that you can do out of Port Everglades. I believe they said Port Everglades is the third largest cruise port. Um, so these new ships will be coming in 2024. Like I said, summertime, that's the Celebrity Beyond, the Enchanted Princess, the Freedom of the Seas, Celebrity Reflection, and the Disney Magic will all have itineraries leaving from Port Everglades starting uh, next summer, 2024. All right, everybody, that is going to do it for another episode of Cruise News. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought about today's Cruise News stories. And as always, everyone, thanks so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video.